Hello there, here we are again in the uh, beautiful region of Puglia. We have a stunning sunny day today and I've been waiting for this day to show you this really cute trullo that we're just taking on now. Uh, we are very close to Celia Messapica here. It's about a 10 minute drive to Celia Messapica and we are located on top of this beautiful hill. Now I kind of want you to see that we do have views uh, just behind you from this position. Uh, obviously the trees are all kind of overgrown so they do need to be cut down a bit but we've got some beautiful views of the rolling hills in this area and this trullo uh, which I can now show you behind me is really something uh, of a project to take on. Obviously there's a substantial amount of work to be done here, um, but it is really a beautiful project for someone to take on because I always kind of state this, location is key and starting a project in the right location means avoiding a lot of issues down the line. Here we have currently, this is 50 square meters of property, but what can be added on is a further 80 square meters of property, either attached to this main trullo already existing or it can be a completely separate villa. We are in a location where you can do a swimming pool as well. So it kind of ticks all the boxes for a good project which you'd want to take on. Um, but without further ado, let me show you uh, the outside of the Trullo uh, area. So you can see here, we basically have a two room setup. They are currently communicating. So there is a, a doorway going through. Unfortunately, I can't show you the inside, but it is literally just two very basic straightforward rooms here. What I really want to show you is the front of this trullo, uh, which is really beautiful. And you can see they have the old style doorways coming in. Obviously we can't go through it now because uh, the, uh, there's a, a bit of plants that have overgrown here. Um, but you can see just how beautiful and picturesque this entrance is. And coming up these two stones, I really want to point out that here, the floor is all the antique Kyanke, and these are so sought after. They are very expensive if you want to put them in. So it's quite unusual to find them still. Uh, so in, in pretty much all of them are still here. So this whole front square to the Trullo is in these antique Kyanke, so it adds a lot of value. But just look how picturesque this Trullo is. We've got the beautiful Pineta just behind it. I mean, I think it's going to be, you know, an amazing project to take on. And it's beginning, becoming more and more difficult to find these types of properties. Uh, I am going to show you the surrounding area because we are in a beautiful location. And again, the location is key. Here we are at the top of the hill. We are very close to a Pineta, which is quite well known, called Pineta Ulmo, which people go to have picnics. So it's a really good location if you kind of want to invest do a property up, a holiday home, and then rent it out as a holiday home. So it's kind of that perfect scenario. Uh, coming round the back here, we have a little pizza oven. And really, this is where you enter the trullo. There is then a room just behind it, which is what you saw from the other side. Uh, and obviously, what you can see is on 1.5 hectares of land. So it's actually a really good plot of land. I'll be showing you the drone video because it really does show you the land and a lot of what you're buying here is the land itself and the position and obviously the very cute trullo which kind of ticks all the boxes. If you have any more questions on this property or any of the others, uh, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Thank you very much.